What's up, everybody? Welcome to Don Flaco Media. Today is another day working on the eight, trying to get it back together. Uh, as I did in the last video, I removed the lower intake manifold because I bought a new one from CX Racing. The old one is over here. It's trash, it was leaking fuel. Well, the fuel was escaping at higher RPMs. So I went ahead and bought another one. Uh, I was waiting on my friend, Danny, the one that built the motor, to weld uh, the one end of the, the fuel rail. Because I'm not a welder, he's a welder. So he welded one end for me, because the previous one, which was this one, the other end was welded. But now, the second step, well, the next step to do is to find the proper fittings. Because I was hoping these fittings, these fittings will fit, but they don't fit, so I'm gonna have to uh, source those out. Yeah, and since everything's apart, I went ahead and uh, decided to paint everything again so I could look fresh. This is the new uh, CX Racing one. Cool. Right there, CX Racing. But y'all wanna paint it and put like a clear coat on it. So my dirty fingertips don't dirty it. But that one's almost done. I just need to put a clear coat on that. But yeah, that's what we're doing today. It's looking nice. Oh, and my mechanic from Puerto Rico came back to help me. <laughs> I couldn't done it without him. But yeah, let me uh, get to this. So I went ahead and got some uh, paint from AutoZone. Got some primer, high resistant heat, and then some uh, regular paint. I'm going with silver so I could get that OEM finish look. I already put the primer on. I'm just doing the, the layers of the gloss paint. So now I'm gonna put the clear coat. This one's already primed up. No importa si deja un chivo, porque la pintura lo coge. Porque ese es primer nada más. Ese es para que la pintura se pegue. Esto es un clear coat para que se vea glossy. Más glossy. Es como para proteger la pintura. Sí. It's gonna be extra shiny. Look, we were doing just fine. This this mother effer decided to land right on it. Ugh. Oh. Yeah. Then we got the ultra high speed dry feet, dry booth. So you got to get a leaf, a leaf blower. 
Uh, the primer's on on this one. We're gonna go ahead and uh, spray it with the gloss. Arayo. Eso. 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 Tirando peor ahí. Respeta, respeta. Oh, they're farting and shit. Oh my god, look what I was about to do. <laughs> I was about to paint my shit. Alright, here we go, here we go. I was about to paint my face. So now we got the clear coat on. I'm gonna get my little leaf blower. This is some backyard shit, so y'all don't judge me. Well, I don't give a fuck if y'all judge me. All right, so clear coat is done on this one. better than it did before. Clear coat is done on this one. I went ahead and put a little little touch. Personal touch. Don't get too close and then you see how shitty it looks, but I did that. I had some uh, touch up paint for the eight inside the car, so I went ahead and filled in the X with the red paint. It looks all right. But ain't nobody gonna see that, honestly. But yeah, now I'm just uh, waiting for it to dry and the next step is to, uh, where that, where that, where that, uh, this piece, I need to find one that'll fit this piece, cause this one's way too fat for here, so that's the next huddle or obstacle I have to get over, I think once I find this piece I could start piecing things back together yeah oh and I gotta fix my friend Danny he told me that the thread in here is kind of wonky he told me he was gonna fix it for me but yeah so fine I gotta find a, the right fitting and fix the thread and I should be good to go to like start assembling things back together but yeah uh Thanks for watching. I'll catch you.